Hi everyone, this is Stan Crane at the Heart, and I'm back um, with some projects using the Waffle Flower Sweet Ice Cream stamp set. Now, I've never used the stamp sets first time, so um, I'm doing a couple videos right now of products, actually quite a few, of using products I've never used before. And this one I've had not that long. I think I, I, think I might have hauled this in the last month or two months ago, so not too long, um, which is good. You know, even though I've got lots of stuff that's old that I need to go and, and use. So that's really, I hope, to get through. Um, anyway, Waffle Flower is having a seven-year anniversary. And so I thought it was a good opportunity to join some of their challenges that they had. So um, the cards I'm showing use this, plus I've got the dies. <clears throat> and I use this Happy Birthday. I think this is a greeting farm die and then this is trendy stamps they have um for their slim line they have a slim line line so use that so this card basically was kind of all the leftover product that i had used because i basically i stamped everything out i colored everything then i cut it out and then i made cards with it because i knew that i i mean coloring is great to do while i'm watching a movie or show i think i just finished watching scarlet and the duke and so that's on PBS. So, um, I mean, it kind of has that Bridgerton feel, but no sex. <laughs> so it's, it's Victorian England. Um, so anyway, it, 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 I enjoyed it. But anyway, I colored a lot of stuff during that show. So anyway, I used um, all the product left for this just to do kind of a, a little slimline card, birthday card. Um, this card I spent a lot of time on and the sort of the sweet shop house dies these are actually from you i believe it's from sunny studio and it's their bag die add-on so they have a bag die and then they have um where you can decorate the bag to make it look like a little sweet shop or a little house or whatever and so I used those add-on dies which you can then use any on any project to make like a house so it's got like the door and the windows it even has like a window box with flowers and it's got these scallops um dies and actually you can make it 3d because I actually um, glued this part down but actually can stick out if you want and so I made it into sort of like a sweet shop and I've got my the little mice there. And I thought that was really adorable. So I made that card. And then I did um, a really simple slim line using uh, my Whimsy dies. And this was just a piece of paper that I had a scrap of that I wanted to use up. And it was just a super simple sort of card says you're as sweet as ice cream <clears throat> and then I really like how this one came out this paper is from La La Land Crafts I got it in my birthday box that I had bought um, not that long ago I actually will be making projects using stuff from that birthday box and um, I need to work on that because I have a lot of images stamped so I am going to work on that um, when I can finally get in my craft room once my flooring is done and I put my life back together again because it's like it's a disaster right now. <clears throat> so this one I just die cut um, the shapes into my card front and then I popped it up on foam tape and um, put together my card and I love how it came out. It's got a dimensional look and this paper is like perfect for it. So really really fun I, I really do like how it came out it says you're as sweet as ice cream and so those are my cards using the waffle flower sweet as ice cream stamp set thank you for watching this is Cindy Frank Art.